What is going on, everybody? It's your boy Alex back here with you. And today, I will be bringing my way too early starting five predictions. Uh, yeah, for opening day 2020 for VCU men's basketball. So, yeah, so make sure you all smash that like button, subscribe to the channel if you are new. So, and then as. Okay, yeah, so now as for the depth chart. Yeah, so VCU does re bring back Bone Thailand. And Trey Clark as their point guards, along with Keyshawn Curry, Jerry McAllister, Norval Tanners in the sixth at the shooting guard position, along with forwards Marcus Santos Silva, Corey Douglas, and Hassan Ward. Yeah, so, uh, yeah, so, and then as for what they, yeah, what they did, were able to bring in a national early signing. They yeah were able to yeah sign four players, um and uh Adrian Baldwin, Josh Banks, Mikhail Browns Jones, and Jameer Watkins. So yeah, Baldwin will be the third string point guard on this team, behind Highland and Clark. Um yeah, so six foot yeah hundred seventy pounds average. Yeah, to Baltimore, average to 11, yeah, yeah, 11, 4, and 7, we'll go along with three steals as a senior at St. Francis Academy. Um, Josh Banks, uh, yeah, average 5 and, yeah, average 24, 5, and 2 as, uh, at Olympic High School. So, yeah, so he'll be the shoot, yeah, he'll be in the shoot, yeah, among the shooting guard pool. For this upcoming season, Brown, yeah, Brown Jones, yeah, six eight two ten. I mean, it has the height. I mean, uh, so, yeah, so we played, uh, yeah, this past season at IMG Academy. Um, yeah, yeah, three star composite rating, and then Jameer Watkins, yeah, also three stars. Um, yeah, we'll be a f yo. Yeah, he like Brown Jones. Yeah, will be among the forwards on the roster. Um, he averaged twenty three and a half a game. Yeah, at yeah senior season at Trenton Catholic. So there is yeah the VCs though uh, weren't able to fill all five. Um, spots left void from this past season. It will be when they'll lose a, a graduate's Malik Crowfield, Marcus Sevens, Deriante Jenkins, Mikel Sims, and Isaac Van. So, yeah, I gotta find a way to, uh, to re yeah, place those for, yeah, five players. They were able to, yeah, replace, uh, yeah, yeah, who were able to, yeah, replace uh, Malik Crowfield. Yeah, placed to, uh, yeah, Mark Sevens with Adrian Baldwin. Um, yeah, yeah, so yeah, so pretty much, yeah, crew field for Josh Banks, and then, yeah, so, yeah, so, uh, yeah, so at least, so, at least as of right now, they got, yeah, yeah, five, uh, yeah, forwards, yeah, four shooting guards, three point guards, and Ben Williams, who can be used interchangeably. As either a shooting guard or a forward. Um, as yeah, as for shooting guards, I feel like VC will probably be, need another one. But then again, that's not gonna be able, possible right now, as the NCAA has suspended all uh, recruiting through I think mid of April. So uh, yeah, because of the whole coronavirus stuff. So so and then as for the starting five, exactly. Um, yeah, I do, I do expect Bond Thailand to take over the point. Guard possession after, yeah. So, and then, as for the shooting guards, I expect those to be, the starting ones to be Keyshawn Curry and Jeremy McAllister. Along, yeah, along with the, yeah, Corey Douglas and Marcus Santos Silva at the forwards. So, yeah, it's so definitely, yeah, I expect a 2-3. Um... So, yeah, guys, yeah, so make sure you all smash that like button. Uh, subscribe if you are new. 
this will be the first part of a five part series when I look at the uh yeah starting lineups for 2020 2021 VCU Vol Sports. Next one we'll be looking at doing is women's basketball. And in that video I will be making my case for Coach Bethel Boyle make going with a two one two defense. So yeah, so you gotta make sure you look out for that. And also we'll be doing uh men's and women's soccer as well as the volleyball. So yeah guys guys make sure to smash that like button, subscribe if you are new. Thanks for signing off. Stay safe.